Nobody's here. It's just your friend Brandar. What are those uh, bee creatures called? I believe they're Spriggans. But Brandar smells fresh water down here. Ah, a feeling of tranquility has come over me as I ascend deeper into this cave. Look at that. Absolutely gorgeous, is it not, friends? My goodness. What is this place? Fascinating. Oh, the water flows freely here. Though I'm not quite sure from where. Hmm. And what is this in the walls? Perhaps it can be used in some sort of uh, alchemical makings, hmm? Very rarely will you find something here in this land that uh, does not have some alchemical property. Hello there, friend. Hello! Yes, indeed I have. Ah, it is quite remarkable. Brandar was uh, just enjoying. Can you tell me more? Elder Gleam Sanctuary. Speak to Astor. Oh, and they have hot springs here as well. Hmm, if Brandar were more one for the water, I might enjoy a little dip. As it is, I think this place is a bit too wet for me to stick around too long. Hmm. And this tree blocks the path. Interesting. Where is this Aster person? I do have just a few questions about this place. Gorgeous. Almost as gorgeous as the Nord women, huh? Hello to you. It's amazing that such beauty could exist in a place as desolate as the volcanic tundra. That is the truth. Uh, could you tell me more? You are in Elder Gleam Sanctuary. Just a small glimpse of what beauty Kinneret has to offer. Wonderful place, isn't it? It is. Uh, Kinneret is quite generous, I do suppose, giving us the fruits and vegetation to enjoy. That uh, large tree over yonder, is that uh, the Elder Gre Gleam that this sanctuary is named after, hmm? Yes, my friend. Though no one has been able to get close to her for as long as I can remember. Hmm, and why is that? As you can see, Elder Gleam's roots are large and stretch far, blocking any path to her trunk. Though, believe it or not, there are rumors of a weapon that even Elder Gleam herself would lift her roots for. More out of fear than respect. Oh, I hate to put fear into such a glorious tree, but I would like to climb it for a little nap. Do you know uh, where I might find such a weapon? Oh, I don't believe those rumors, my friend. Besides, who would ever want to harm such beauty? Now, if you'll excuse me, I have nothing more to discuss. I encourage you to take your time and enjoy yourself. You look like you could use the rest. Yes, indeed I could. Uh, and if it were a bit more dry here, I might rest a bit longer. But as it is, I must be on my way. And we will keep an eye out for this legendary weapon, which might move the Elder Gleam. Ah, she says that uh, whoever has the weapon is going to harm the tree. Well, if the tree moves its, its roots, then Brandar would not be forced to harm it, hmm? I did not even try a fire spell upon it. Such is my respect for the wilds here. Ah. But the Nords are distrusting of almost everyone, I do think. Regardless, this is not Corvan Jund, so we must be off again, friends. I would like to uh, find this place that Galmar spoke of and help out my Stormcloak brethren. But, uh... I will need a bit more specific directions, I do think, if I am ever to find it. As it is now, we are just wandering through the wilderness. Hmm. Hello, Richard, my friend. Lovely to see you. It's been such a long time, hmm? <laughs> ah, that's a little joke, because it's not been so long at all. Ah! Volcanic Tundra. 
It is quite interesting. Away from the wolves, Richard. We'll have none of that. Hmm. And what is this? Apronax stone. Ah, do the wolves follow? Perhaps they have grown somewhat of a brain, huh? One. Two. Ah. And your friend has somewhat of a death wish, I see. Yes, point blank. One does not want to waste arrows. Hmm. Especially these delicious orcish arrows. Such damage do they do. What is this stone? Hmm. A larger pool of magicka, but recover more slowly. Absorb a portion of incoming spell damage. No, I don't think this is for Brandar. I've become quite partial to the spells. I find myself using them quite a bit, hmm? Let us see if we can't uh, get our arrows back from these wolves. No, this one is broken. How about here? Ah. That looks recyclable. Oh my. A dragon over yon. Hmm. Is he coming for us? Where is Richard? Richard, my friend. Help me to escape this. Oh my. Brandar does not want a fight if he can avoid one. What is this place that the dragon is circling? A town of some sort? Ah, but Brandar is no hero. Hmm. I wish these people luck. But there's not a, a whole lot that I could do for them, I think. We must uh, find the... The Corvan Jund. Oh my, he's just circling there, hmm? He's not breathing any flames. I suppose that is okay. He doesn't seem to have a target in mind. Mistwatch. Greetings! Unless you've come to pay a ransom, turn around and walk away. A ransom, hmm? Okay, I, I don't have anyone to ransom here. Yes, I'm I'm going away now. <laughs> so he thinks. Richard, watch out. Yes, my horse has come to pay a ransom. Nobody's here. Oh, do not harm my horse. If you harm Richard, you are going to be in big trouble, my friend. This I warn you. Hmm, let us see. Dwarven sword. Yes, I think this will do quite nicely. Oh! How's that? Try to block this. <laughs> ah, it's quite resistant to the flames. Ah! I thought he might burn a bit more quickly with the fur armor. Back, back, back. Ah! Burn! That's right. Don't mess with the kitties. I must ask, why do these orcs always seem to uh, find their way into trouble, hmm? They always wish to fight the kitty. Hmm. And they seem to have... Uh, Lost my trail just a little bit. Let's see if we can sneak up and around. Hopefully the dragon does not find his way over here. Or perhaps he could uh, help us out just a little bit. Hmm. But I'd rather not have to deal with him after the orcs are dealt with, hmm? They seem to have killed a goat here. Oh my. Yes, we've been caught. Surely enough. Hmm. Perhaps a little oak flesh might help me. In these times of trial. Ha! 
Yes, quite nice it is. Hmm. And fire. Oh. Hmm. It seems they have some elves with them. But I'm not so scared of the tiny daggers. There you are, friend. You enjoy burning so? <laughs> yes, just let me recharge a little bit. Focus my mind on the flames. Yes. You'll make a fine rug. I can't say the same for you. Your skin is not so pretty, huh? <laughs> but still, I should like to have it. Oh my. Ah. Down he goes. I cannot best you. You've got that right. Ah. Ah. Just hide for a moment. Where are my potions? Hmm. Yes. Just a few of these should help. Hiding in the bush, are you? <laughs> so like an elf. Ah. But it won't save you. No, indeed. Ah. But some orcish arrows. I find that, uh... Very generous of you, friend. Hmm, knapsack. Yes, I think my uh, backpack is just a little bigger than this one, is it not? Hmm, yes. I like my backpack a bit more. Well, it seems we've uh, cleared the outside of this place. But uh, my curiosity gets the better of me. Is that dragon still wandering about? He surely is. Hmm. I can only wonder what is over that way. What he might be circling. Hopefully it is not the storm cloaks that he has found. But one never does know. Hmm. I'll see if I can't get a better vantage point. Hmm. Much mead and ale in here? Yes. That's quite nice, isn't it? Everyone enjoys a good drink, I do suppose. Including Brandar from time to time. Although I have not yet touched the skooma in my pack. Again, it is uh, a bit hard to go adventuring when you uh, are losing your mind just a little bit. Something that I should have realized uh, way back in Morrowind, but I was younger then, friends. A bit more foolish, yes? Ah. Here we are. Let us see. What secrets this place might hold. Yes, the bandits do always have a, a good store of loot, do they not? Hmm. And everyone knows how Brandar enjoys the loot. <laughs> It's a play on the words, you see. Hmm. I did smell him right before he heard me. Any of who? Ah, you are not a bandit, are you? Stendar's mercy, you aren't one of them. Please, you've got to help me. And who are you? What what do you need help with? I think she's being held in this tower. Okay, just tell me how did this happen? I'm sorry, I just... You're right. Let me explain. Fiola, my wife, left the farm on errands and never came back. It's been months, and I've been searching for her since. I heard a rumor that these bandits were ransoming captives, so I thought she may be here. I managed to sneak past the guards and get this far, but I don't think I can go on. I'm no warrior. Please. Can you look for her? <laughs> yeah, you haven't gotten very far at all, friends. Uh, there were only four guards to sneak past outside. I'm sure this place is crawling with many more. <sighs> Are you sure that she's being held here? Honestly, I have no idea. But I've looked all over, and the kidnappings here started around when she disappeared. 
So I have to hope. Well, I shall have a look for her. Brandar's mostly here for the loot, but uh, if I do see her wife, I shall tell you that uh, I shall tell her that you are looking for her. How does that sound? Thank you. I don't have much, but I can give you some coin for the trouble. One of the guards dropped this key while I hid. I wager it'll come in handy for you. Please hurry. <laughs> the guards dropped the key. You get what you pay for, I suppose. Now you can find out whether Fiola is here. There's nothing I care to discuss. Well, just hold on a moment. Let me uh, have a look through some of these things. We might have something that uh, helps us get to the top of the tower and free this woman. Hmm. Ingots, stamina, septums, hmm. And the battle axe. I will leave for you, friend. If they do come for you, look in the chest. There's nothing I care to discuss. Well, I'm trying to tell you, look in the chest if they do come for you, okay? There's battle axe inside. Hi, these people. Don't listen. Oh my. I did not uh, bother to try and smell through this door. It might have been quite a mistake, hmm? Hello? Oh! Nobody's here. Nobody's here. It's just your friend Brandar. You remember me? I'm sure you don't. Oh my goodness. Oh my. I'm sorry, Mr. Christer. I'm so sorry. I have to leave now. Goodbye. Oh, that uh, was an unfortunate accident. He did attempt to help me with uh, the steel battle axe, but <laughs> I mistook him for one of the bandits. My mistake. Has, has he forgotten? Has all been forgiven? I do hope. Oh, he's not going to let down. Okay, goodbye. Farewell then. Good luck uh, searching for your wife. One, two, three, four. Goodbye, goodbye, see you again. Goodbye, goodbye, see you, my friend.